outlandish remarks, but tonight, American right-wing pundit Ann Coulter left a sour taste in some people's mouths. She spoke tonight at the University of Western Ontario, where one student stormed out. Anna Vlacos joins us live to explain why. Anna. Tara, during a question and answer period, Fatima Aldahar says Coulter's response to her was extremely offensive. Should I be converted to Christianity? Second of all, since I don't have a magic carpet, what other roles do you suggest? This University of Western student read aloud some of Ann Coulter's quotes, the first, that Americans should invade Muslim countries, kill their leaders, and convert them to Christians. Fatima Aldahar also referred to another quote where Coulter said Muslims should use magic carpets as an alternate mode of transportation. As a female, as a Muslim, as a student of this university, I felt an obligation to kind of represent that. Coulter didn't deny she made the statements. She began to reply to Aldahar's questions. American politics. I got up and left because it was absolutely ridiculous. She's talking about political correctness, and right there, she blatantly just she stabbed me in the heart. That was rude. Use your camel. I mean, come on. A few audience members left soon after. Still, it was a packed room at the North Campus building. Many had lined up to get in to hear Coulter's speech. As a U.S. conservative critic, Coulter is known to make outrageous remarks and to push buttons. And just a quick correction. Earlier tonight on A News at 6, we mistakenly reported that Megan Walker was organizing a protest against Coulter. Walker says she does disapprove of Coulter's appearance, but that no protest was ever planned. Tara? All right. Thanks a lot, Anna.